This is Memphis, Tennessee, where one can see Graceland, Beale Street, and this tremendous college football game coming up. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Logan has the ball set how he wants it, and we're just about ready to kick this game off, folks. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. They go with a run, and he brought down in the backfield. He's tackled at the 35. Nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Caught it, but they're going to lose yards. He was tackled immediately. And they'll lose a yard there. Not much going on there. Those kind of plays will not work against this defense. You can be sure of that. From their own 34-yard line. Second down. Mike 17. And off to the left. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. No game on the play. 17. Watch the pass. Watch the pass. Here we go. Here we go. Kill, 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 kill. He heaves it deep. And he snags that one. And they make the stop at about the 15-yard line. You know, they did a great job here of not just getting past the first down marker, but picking up some major yards on the play. It's the tailback. Runs outside for a nice game. That'll make it second and four. He might have a chance. Breaks one and scores. What a spectacular run by the quarterback. That is such a weapon for your offense when you have a quarterback who can do things like that. The coach probably loves drawing up plays for this guy. And he converts the extra point. A seven-play, 76-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. He's to the 20. Tackle made the 24-yard line. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. He's taken down at about the 35. Good solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. Here we go, here we go. Red two. Tackle at about the 47 yard line. Call it a gain of 12 yards. First down. Run there. Call it a gain of seven yards. That'll bring up second and two. And he just gets rid of it. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. 
Third down and three coming up. Ball on the 46-yard line. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Excellent job here by the defense to sniff that one out before it turned into a first down. goes around the 33 yard line that makes it first and 10 makes the catch and look out they'll bring him down around the 20 yard line that's good for a gain of 13 yards first down Quick throw out to the receiver. And they push him out at the three. That's good for a gain of 17 yards. That makes it first and goal. Got his receiver. Touchdown. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he tacks on the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Brought down at the 20-yard line. The penetration by the defense was so good on that play that it didn't matter who the ball carrier was. Anyone would have been brought down for a loss. Second down, and they've got 15 for the first down. Ball on the 20-yard line. Quick strike to the receiver. And he's tackled right around the 22-yard line. That'll make it good in 13. Jones gains about four yards there. That'll bring up fourth and nine. Williams is the putter. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Moore takes it to 28. He's taken down at the 35-yard line. When he made the decision to return the ball, I'm sure he thought there was going to be some room to run. But boy, did it vanish in a hurry. Still, he got something out of it. They did a great job on their last drive, moving the ball down the field for a touchdown. Let's see if they can duplicate that on this drive. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this defense. And he's taken down right around midfield. Slings it. Tackle made the 39-yard line. Carter brings him down to the 39-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. That's a game of seven on the way. That'll bring up second and three. Gets to about the 24-yard line. From the 24-yard line, it's second down. And he's tackled after 
positive yardage. That's a D. Come on, D. That'll make it third and one. Mike 35. Man. Get him. Get him. He scrambled. He takes off. He's tackled at the 16 yard line. That's a D. First down. 35 to the right. Come on, oh, come on, oh. Gets it out to his receiver, and he can't hang on. Sanders intended to see the other play. Tenth play of the drive. Looking for his man, incomplete. The pass falls as he completes. Jackson's intended to see the other play. So we're looking at another third down here. Throw caught touchdown. These guys need to be aware this aerial attack is capable of making some big plays. They've got to get on their toes. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Logan has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Run up the middle. That brings him second and five. Quick throw. There's a strike complete. He gets hit out of bounds around the 50 yard line. That makes it first and 10. quickly and he's got his man and they make the stop right around the 46 yard line that reception good for around four yards the play action throws the defense just long enough for the quarterback to get the ball to the receiver nice play makes it out to about the 36 from the 36 yard line it's first down He's scrambling, runs with it, and he's got room. And he hits him hard at the 24. He's scrambling, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. A defensive end with this kind of speed is an offense's worst nightmare. He's got the ability yeah, to collapse the pocket on any given pass play. And as a play caller, you constantly have to be aware of it. Whether you're going to roll away from him or you're going to chip with a tight end or a running back, you're constantly concerned and aware of a big, strong defensive end. So that sack sets him back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. Quick throw to the tight end. He's taken down right around the 12-yard line. Seventeen. Loss of five yards. That'll bring 
on second and 15. This is the 11th play of this drive. play and it's going to be first and goal. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. Zipped it out and that was almost picked off. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. That brings up a second and goal. All on the two. Will be tied with the extra point. He makes the PAT. Patterson has the ball set and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. That's a gain of eight on the play. That, that makes it first and ten. Mike 35, Mike Jump, four. Check. Orange three. Throws complete. He's got room to work. And he's shoved out of bounds around the 48-yard line. First down. And a quick throw. Tackle at the 40-yard line. Thomas makes the tackle at the 40-yard line. First down. Makes it out to about the 30. Gain 10 yards. That makes it first and 10. Throws it in a hurry. That's a great tackle at the 26. That's a game of four on the That makes it seven. We've played six. one. We're deadlocked right now at 14. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Three down, three down. 35 to Mike. And down he goes at about the 21. Herbert on the tackle at the 21 yard line. Third down. Dog four. Green 15. Makes it to the eight. Gain of 13 yards. That makes it first and goal. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's good for a game of three yards. That brings them second and goal. They'll bring him down right around the two yard line. That makes his third and goal. Touchdown, Mississippi. And he adds the extra point. Low 
Hogan looks ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. Brad, this is my kind of game. I love seeing this kind of production and the way these quarterbacks are playing. Both teams are challenging both of these defenses. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. And they'll bring him down behind the line. That is exactly the type of play that good linebackers make on a regular basis. And if you can make enough of them in college, you're probably going to get a chance to play at the next level. Scrambling around. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Slides down. Now he tries to buy some time. Brought down at the 32. On the tackle. That's good for a gain of two yards. Fourth down. Certainly, they don't have the return on here. And this one is a beauty. Gets to about the 34-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Ole Miss up seven points. Up the middle for a nice game. That'll bring up second and three. Phillips takes the give. He tackles him for a loss. After a decent run up the gut. That's good for a gain of five yards. First down. First down grab by the receiver. That's a gain of 13 on the ball. First down. Dangerous throw. This one's picked off. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Tigers. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he hits the PAT. is lining up to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So the offense will come back out onto the field hoping for a little better result than that last pick six. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off of mistakes. And he's tackled at the 36-yard line. First and ten. Three down, three down. Mike three. Mike three. Kill, kill, kill. Kill. He makes it to the 38-yard line. Game two yards. That makes it second and eight. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a game of seven yards. That'll make it third and one. He's at the 40. He makes his way to about the 32. That's good for a game of 20 yards. 
first down. Kill, kill, kill! kill. kill. Three. He's at the 20. He gets out to about the 17-yard line. Gaining 15 yards. First down. Here's the give. Gets to about the 14-yard line. That'll make it 77. From the 14-yard line, second down. And he tackles him hard at the 22. That's a loss of eight yards. Here's the eighth play of the series. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. He looked like he just sort of aimed that one. Yeah, he didn't look very natural throwing the football there, and the result was an underthrow. Fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. Ole Miss is looking to go up by three. Kicks away. And it splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. The quarterback in the gun with five receivers. He's going to try and scramble. And they got him. Second and long. Ball on the 20 yard line. Mike 17, Mike 17, red two. They go with the run. And he's taken down right around the 22 yard line. That'll make it third and 13. made the 39-yard line. Fires out to his wideout. Fires it out. He's at the 20. Inside the 10. He's knocked out of bounds around the four-yard line. Finds his receiver. Touchdown. converts the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. 
This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I love the competitive spirit that we're seeing out on this field today. It looks like one team has the upper hand, and then the other comes right back in to be able to regain the lead. It's going to be an exciting finish. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Finds his man, and they take him down immediately. Gaining four yards. That makes it second and six. Makes it out to about the 40. First down. Kill, kill, kill! Orange three! Orange three! They try to run up the middle, but met in the backfield. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. We've watched this guy play, and over the course of his college career, he's made some spectacular tackles. Nice play. Delayed handoff, and he's not going to get back to the line. Third down now, and they need to get it out to midfield. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Brown is the putter. Booming kick. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync with his wide receivers. These guys have worked all week on their preparation to attack this defense, and right now it's really paying off. There's a strike complete, and they make the stop at the 30. Memphis holds a four-point lead. And he just gets rid of it. From their own 30-yard line, second down. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Throws a bullet. He's at midfield. It's caught. First down, and he's out of bounds. Taken down at the 43. I think it was a great play call, and it was very well executed. Any coach would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. He's scrambling. Loose football. And the defense is on it. That's a pretty big mistake, and this offense will lose possession of the football. Sloppy job by the ball carrier. First and foremost, you should always be concerned about the ball. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Quick throw out to the receiver. He's tackled at the 44. The slant pattern, good for about eight yards on the play. So it's second down and about two yards to go. They'll spread the field with five wide. And a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. So the pass is complete for an eight-yard gain and a first down. Great look from the quarterback to find his receiver and make the quick throw for the new set of downs. Quick strike, and he drops it. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. He zips it. Smart, heady play by that defender. That was solid, fundamental pass defense. That brings up third and ten. Looking for his man, incomplete. They'll call on the field goal unit. The kick is away. It's long enough. And he splits the uprights. Ole Miss is ready to kick it away. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone. Down for a touchback. Last time the offense had it, they lost a fumble. So I'm pretty sure the coaching staff was over there talking about ball security. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. Tackle around the 32-yard line. That's a game of seven. That'll bring up second and three. Memphis is up one. He's on the run, and they bring him down for a sack on the play. Five yards the play. That'll, That'll bring, bring up third, up third and eight. eight. From their own 27-yard line, it's third down. We've still got a half of football remaining. The Tigers lead it by one. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Ole Miss is hanging around. They're clawing at their elbows and knees. They're scratching and fighting and trying to hang in there. And I think a lot of people would look at this, David, as an opportunity for a moral victory. Do you believe in moral victories? Uh, to an extent. I mean, I think you can you can definitely take hope with a moral victory or take something from a moral victory if you do it at the end of 60 minutes. Right now, it's 30 minutes. If, you, if you're down by eight at the half, Reese, and then you get beat by 35, guess what everybody sees? You got beat by 35. So great start. Is it a moral victory for the first half? Yes, but I'm also within one possession and in a position to strike in the second half and possibly go win this puppy. David and I will be keeping an eye on your game and everything else going on in the country here in our palatial and comfortable surroundings in the studio. The best seat in the house belongs to Brad Nessler in Kirk Herb Street. Great first half. Hopefully the second half's as good. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. They'll bring him down at the 26-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And down he goes at the 32-yard line. Gain of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. He flings it. And got him! To the 20. They'll bring him down at the six. Gain of 62 yards. That makes it first, first and goal. Mike 35. Fires quick out to the receiver and he can't make the grab. It's second and goal. Six yards to the end zone.
He goes out of bounds. Right around the two-yard line. Touchdown, Mississippi. It takes a lot of strength to run it when you're heading into a massive pile of bodies. Good job of holding on to it and getting it across the goal line. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. Logan has his kick team lined up and he is set to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Now he tries to buy some time. Brought down at the 29. That makes it second and six. Quick strike to the receiver. And he's tackled right around the 30. And that brings up fourth down. Great stop by the defense. They played with tremendous character on those downs. Williams is waiting for the snap. He's taken down at the 39. Not a bad return. The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Strike to his receiver, no good. Second and 10, ball on their own 39. Ole Miss is up by a touchdown. Fires that quickly, incomplete. He throws a dart to the left. More was the intended target. That's going to bring up fourth down. It's a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. Brown awaits the snap. Oh, excellent punt. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. That'll make it second to seven. Run play and he'll lose yards. Loss of three yards on the play. That brings up third and ten. Man left, man left. Third and ten coming up. Ball on the 27. Taken down at about the 39-yard line. 
He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That brings him second in five. And a quick throw. Tackle made around the 31 yard line. That's good for a game of four yards. That'll bring up 32. Hey, check Mike 46. Check Mike 46. Easy. He's pushed out of bounds at about the 21. In the air, it's intercepted. Not a good decision there. Why do you even throw that back? Well, it's a good job by the corner of sitting back and reading the quarterback's eyes. Good job of disguising coverage as well. From their own 20-yard line, it's first down. Ole Miss is up a score. Throws it in a hurry. Breaks one, and he is drilled at the 23. That'll make it 77. Mike 35, Mike 35. Six man. Check for a Go for it. They'll get him for a loss. He was never able to get ahead of steam on that carry. From their own 22 yard line. Third down. Throws in the middle, and they make the stop around the 26 yard line. That makes it fourth and four. Williams, the return man. Williams fields at the 31, and he's tackled at the 37. Quarterback couldn't maintain possession on their last drive. Let's see what he does here. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I wouldn't be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. Nice run to the left there. After a decent pickup. That makes it so Second and ten. He's out of bounds at the 45 yard line. Makes it to the 42-yard line. That's good for a game of three yards. That'll make it third and one. He fights forward to about the 39. Nice run, and he's brought down. That'll make it second and seven. From the 35-yard line, it's second down. Up the middle for a nice game. That's a game of four on the Third down. 
Quick throw, incomplete, one on his receiver. He put a little bit too much mustard on that throw, and it got away from him. It's fourth down, so the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and it's good. He didn't make it by much, but it counts. That certainly wasn't the best kick of his career, but it did do the job. And like Brad said, it counts. Patterson looks ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. Well, the Tigers' defense, I thought they looked lost in the first half, and it seems like they finally found their bearings here in the third quarter. I think they were confused in the first half, and I think they've made the right adjustments. And right now, boy, they're playing with an attitude, and I think they're really attacking this offense much better than the way they look early in this game. Ole Miss holds a four-point lead. Got his receiver, but it's knocked out. It's second and ten. Ball on the 22. And he's stopped behind the line. I'll tell you what, for a defensive back, this kid is a sure tackler, and he showed it right there. corner gets to about the 44 yard line this deficit can be easily overcome sure but they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series the burden is going to be felt by their defense they give to the tailback he makes it out to maybe the 46 yard line that's good for two yards that makes, that makes it second and eight, eight. He's going to try and scramble. Decides to slide. Quick strike and he drops it. That'll make it fourth down, and they're going to have to punt. Yeah, they just couldn't connect on the pass there. That was a very good stand by this defense. Fourth and five. Moore awaiting the return. He takes it at the 12. Brought down at the 17-yard line. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Ole Miss is up by four. He's tackled around the 19-yard line. It's been an offensive explosion through three quarters of play. We head to the fourth quarter. The Rebels lead it by four. Well, this final few minutes is going to determine this one. Tight ball game. Action set to start here in the fourth quarter. And he hits him hard at the 35. And he throws right away. Sanders was the intended receiver on the way. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 35-yard line. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Aaron and out long. That's good for a game. 
The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Fires it out, and he's tackled right away. First down. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That makes it second and six. Kill, kill, kill. And three. He throws. Zips it to his receiver. Touchdown. Splits the uprights with the extra point. Logan gets set to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It's going to be interesting to see how the action shakes out in this series. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. He's taken down at the 26 yard line. That's a loss of four yards. That'll make it 39. From their own 26 yard line, third down. They go with a screen, incomplete. Three plays and no first down, and now it's decision time for this offense. Well, the defense did what they had to do so far. They're showing a lot of heart out there. Williams to punt. He's at midfield. They'll bring him down at the 42. Now, what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Well, I think this whole offense is really clicking, and it's allowing him as a quarterback just to settle in and find his rhythm. And he's shown earlier on that touchdown that this guy can also hurt you with his feet. So he's a guy you have to be aware of, not just with his ability to throw the ball, but also be aware of his athletic ability. Can it be that he'll lead his team to an impressive upset win? Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. That makes it first and ten. Three down, three down. Key 15, key 15. He just gets rid of it. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Mike 35, Mike 35. From the 30 yard line, second down. Pass complete and taken down immediately. That's good for the game of seven yards. He has some room. Tackle right around the 12 yard line. That's a game of 11 on the play. First down. He finds the mic. And down he goes right around the two yard line. Called a game of 10 yards. That makes it first and goal. Second down and goal. Two yards to the end zone. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. Got the corner. Touchdown, Rebels. 
That is great, tough football right there. Getting down to the goal line and just punching it in. And he adds the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Their last drive broke down and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? And he's tackled right around the 38-yard line. Set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. He's at the 40, inside the 30. Brought down right around the 10-yard line. Now, this team obviously did not have a great game today, but they're capable of making plays like this. And maybe a play like this can give them the confidence to try to get into the next game next week and realize, guys, this is what we're capable of doing. And unfortunately, we just didn't have a great game today. Fires out to his receiver. Touchdown, Tigers! So the offense is going to go for two. He's on the run. They got it. Memphis is lining up to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Let's find out if the defense has made any adjustments after giving up a touchdown on that last drive. He's got it with room to run, and they push him out right around the 34. You can tell he's got a lot of faith in his wide receivers. Even when he's a little bit off target, they can pull it in and make something happen. Good tackle there in space. That makes it first and ten. Complete. He's got room. They'll bring him down at about the 47-yard line. That'll make it second and four. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And he's taken down right around the 46-yard line. First made at the 45. He laterals. They bring him down in the backfield. These guys have the capability to gain solid, consistent yardage. They have to regroup, come out a bit more motivated next time. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 36. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. There's a strike complete, and he's down. He gets it up. And it's wide left, no good. Every time you have a chance to finish a drive with points, you've got to capitalize. That time, they couldn't come through. This offense did really well with the air attack on their last trip out there. Let's see if they can do the same thing here. 
I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync with his wide receivers. These guys have worked all week on their preparation to attack this defense, and right now it's really paying off. Complete, almost picked off. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. From the 48 yard line, it's second down. Slings it. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 33 yard line. That gives him 100 yards in the game. Well, this guy is such a big part of this offense. If he doesn't get his numbers, they usually don't have much success moving the football. And he throws it away. From the 33-yard line, second down. Looks middle, got his back. And they make the stop right around the 20. Huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. We're at play number nine of this current drive. And he makes it out to about the five-yard line. He's lucky just to get back to the line of scrimmage on that option. That makes us third and goal. Rose, and he's got a man. Touchdown. He has three scoring tosses in the game now. He's been letting it fly today, and his receivers are making plays. That is a great touchdown. What's more amazing than anything else is that these guys are still losing. Trying to get within a field goal. They'll try the point after. And he hits the PAT. A nice 10-play, 61-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. You, know, you can throw the football as well as these guys can. You don't necessarily always have to have a balanced attack because you're so proficient in throwing the ball. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Man, hang on to your hats, folks, because both these offenses are in gear right now. Well, the way these guys are executing right now, it could come down to just which defense can come up with one stop. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Less than three minutes in the game. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Tries to get around the corner. He's to the 40. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. The Tigers will use their first time out of the half. From their own 49-yard line, it's first down. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's tackled at the 40. The offense was pretty successful on that play there. That was a very good passing play to get the ball downfield for a very nice gain and a first down. Here we go, here we go, here we go. 
Quick throw, picked off. Big opening. And he tackles him hard at the 40-yard line. Bad, bad turnover right there with a chance to get back in the game, and they come up with an interception. From the 40-yard line, first down. Offense lines up in a five-wide set in the defense, anticipating pass here. Now he tries to buy some time, and they got it. This quarterback has to do a better job of avoiding the rush, because sacks can be real drive killers. Just under two minutes in the game. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. That's a team of one on the play. Third down. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. Well, a lot of frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. It's fourth down. They call on the kicker for a long field goal. The kick is up, and it's wide right. No good. So they come up empty-handed there. Kickers have to have a short memory. Just go out and make the next one. Here we are late in the fourth quarter, and this is what this game has come down to. Every possession's gonna count, and this could be the one right here. He makes it to the 38-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. Man, it's difficult to run on this defense when they put this kid up in the box. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Here's a run. Gets to about the 44-yard line. Brown is the punter. Really great game to watch. Both teams should be proud of their efforts in this one. Ole Miss, 49, Memphis, 46. So Kirk, how would you sum up the action in this one? This has certainly been a special game to remember. Memphis made a few more mistakes in this game than their opponents. But whether it's turnovers, penalties, missed tackles, or blown assignments, you just can't afford to make mistakes and expect to win. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.